Thursday night, the arena was electrifying, and the congregation eagerly awaited the presence of none other than Sam Kerr. The cathedral echoed with cheers, every pew filled with devoted fans. The fervor was immense, and they went to extraordinary lengths to secure a ticket. They went beyond just selling out stadiums. They printed articles and news on every available surface, singing praises and declaring their faith in Sam Kerr. Her aura was felt everywhere, from the airport to street corners and even on social media platforms like TikTok. Cameras were ready to capture every moment of her brilliance. But fate had a cruel twist as Kerr suffered an injury, putting her on the bench during Australia's crucial opening match against Ireland. Even the support of thousands of fans and the young chants couldn't heal her injured calf. However, she remained a guiding force, delivering a pep talk to her teammates, reminding them of their own capabilities, and the overwhelming support from the crowd. Questions loomed about how the Matildas would fare without their star player. Yet, they fought valiantly, and Steph Catley stepped up as the stand-in captain, leading them to a hard-fought 1-0 victory over Ireland with a penalty kick. While not a perfect performance, it was enough to secure a crucial win. Coach Tony Gustafsson acknowledged the challenges and areas for improvement in their play, knowing they needed to fine-tune their strategies before their next match against Nigeria. As for Ireland, their defensive prowess made the game a tough battle for Australia, but they will have another challenging encounter with Olympic champions Canada. In the end, the Matildas emerged victorious, with Kerr's spirit still fueling their determination. The World Cup had its face, its name, Sam Kerr. And though she couldn't grace the field that night, her presence and impact reverberated through every moment of the match. The journey had just begun, and Australia had proven their resilience in the face of adversity.